I love all the snow here. It's awesome. Ah, more snow coming through. Subscribe to our channel for lots of fun videos posted every day. Hey, lots of toys fans. It's Miriam. Patrick! We're going to open a fun new toy today. It's a construction set and it includes a lot of accessories. It's a giant box and it includes a play mat with it. There are signs, excavators, fire trucks. And a big truck, guys. A helicopter, cones, barriers, signs. And at the end, we're going to open some surprise blind boxes. But now, let's go ahead and take a look at the back of our box. Here's the play mat that's included. And it's a die cast metal and plastic vehicles. Awesome, let's go ahead and open this up. Awesome toy. And it actually includes a lot of toys. Look at all the construction machines and signs included. So let's set up the mat first. Let's close off the roll. So here's the mat. And it's really awesome. It's actually a construction site. We've got all kinds of signs. Now let's set up our machinery so they can do the work. Yeah, we have to make sure that we block off this road. What happens if you don't block off the road? The cars are gonna crash. Yeah, they're gonna go off the road. We don't want that. So we have to close the road. Awesome. What else are you putting on there? Yeah, caution. It's a construction site. And look, there's a sign over here. what's next here's our fun little helicopter it's a rescue helicopter these kind of trucks are allowed to go in here right I have one of these yeah we have another one of those we have a what is this a front loader so this is our first truck included in the set then we have this front loader. This looks more like a robot, doesn't it? Like a little tiny robot That's one. It's not a robot. It's got a working scoop. And next up, we have this cement mixer. And it does lift and lower. Remember, all of these are die cast material. And of course, we have our dump truck. This can reach high places. And what kind of a truck is that? The truck that extends so it can cut the trees. When you when you put it back, you just fold it and then you lower it. Now we have our fire truck. This is an awesome fire truck. It has all the gear on it. It's part of the crew to make sure everyone is working safely. Hong Kong! Look who's coming. It's our Enviro Grav Transporter. It's a really fun truck. It actually transports gravel. It has this trailer that removes. You can remove it. Why does it transport gravel? Oops. Because at a construction site, you have a lot of gravel, a lot of dirt that you're moving about, right? From one place to another.
time to open the presents. Let's see, what do we have in the first one? This is a special one that Patrick actually put together for you. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's lots of snow. What's in there? What else? Play-Doh. You got a can of Play-Doh. Oh, and a dump of snow. Awesome. <laughs> Look at this. You can turn this can upside down. And what do you have here? You have a barrel, a construction barrel. I love all the snow here. It's awesome. Ah, more snow coming through. Looks like it's snowing here. We have one more box to open. A surprise box. Let's I put snow on the box. Let's dust it off and open it and see what's inside. Oh, there's snow coming out. And what else? Oh, look at this fun, cute guy. Ah, he's getting dumped with snow. And it's an M&M twist and pour dispenser. He's a snowman, so perfect. Snow and snowman with it. And he's a red guy. Here we have one more box to there open. There was a snowstorm. I know. Let's go ahead and open this box up and see what do we have inside. Santa! Who is it? Santa! Santa Claus Skittles Twist and Pour Santa Claus. That's some fun candy we got today. Look at this. Check out this fun new playset I'm going to open and play with. It's a fireman's playset. It includes a lot of fireman figurines, vehicles, signs, equipment, and there's even a helicopter over here. We're going to open this up and have a really fun story today. Attention all units, there's an emergency at the park. Available vehicles respond. Included in the collection is also this tanker. It has an emergency response tool at the top, a water gun. Look at this. The back actually extends. Guys, we have all our equipment, so let's go now. guys I've called for help those firemen should be here shortly hey guys what do you think we should do I think we should bring a high ladder so we can get the cat and the dog down easy okay guys we do need the vehicle with the big ladder we need it right here Okay, little guy, come on down. Roof, roof. You get a good pool on your face. It's okay, little doggy. Come on, come on down. Do what your cat friend did. Ow. Hey, I want to turn two. Me four. Me five. Ah, I'm stuck. <laughs> Included in the collection are a bunch of signs, different kinds. There's a danger sign here as well, and a bunch of cones. There's a fire truck with an extending ladder. A fire chief's jeep with all the extra equipment. There's an emergency unit response vehicle, sort of like a minivan. The awesome extending fire truck. It has a ladder that extends. It's ready for emergencies. 
There's a fire and rescue helicopter. It has an extending and closing back so you can make it bigger. Moving rotors, of course. There are some lights and a fire extinguisher included, as well as some barrels. I have a very fun new set for you I'm going to open today. It's another construction set, and it includes a lot of fun vehicles. Excavators, front loaders, bulldozers, and a lot of fun accessories as well, including construction workers, construction materials, and signs. And look at this awesome construction vehicle. Let's go ahead and open it up and have some fun with it. Look at all the stuff you get in this set, including a play mat. We're going to go ahead and take a look at everything in detail and play with some Play-Doh. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at our vehicles. Here's the first one. It's the cement mixer. And this is plastic and die cast materials. It says JCM Construction Cement Mixer. Next up we have this track excavator. It has a large scoop that actually is a working scoop and this top part over here is die cast with some plastic parts while the bottom is plastic you can see the wheels right at the bottom here's a vehicle that actually lifts up it helps construction workers reach high places there's a basket here for the figurine and we can place our worker right in there and just lift him up Look how high he can go! And then lower him down to safety after he's finished with the work. There are three construction workers included and they're all working. They have their construction gear. There's also a front loader, JCM Superior, and there's a working scoop. Also, the middle pivots for easy maneuver. There are two trucks included, project it says, and then work on this one. And they have a bed that actually dumps the material and the back opens so you can release whatever you're carrying. Here's the other one, also dumps the bed. The back also lifts. They're both die cast and plastic. There are a bunch of signs, barrels, cones as well as this railroad crossing that has a speed limit sign and this one lifts and lowers so you can place it on your train track there are some construction materials included three of them and there's a sign here a barrier that says caution and do not cross beyond this point we have more signs included there's a truck king cool sign here there's a pedestrian crossing sign do not enter and one-way sign that's standing free and these stand free signs that are in this neat little rack there's a give way sign, a stop sign, do not enter sign, a parking sign, a slow sign a this way street sign and no left turn here we are at our construction site and our construction workers are busy working they're actually working on a residential street and they have a lot of work to do one of the workers has been lifted on top of the house over here so he can do some repairs to the wires that have been broken and when he's done he's going to be lowered down to the ground and he can safely get out. Next up, we have some digging that needs to be done here. We have our front loader doing its job. And also our excavator, our track excavator. His cabin is flexible so he can move all around. Here come the rest of the trucks for reinforcement. They're bringing materials and the rest of the equipment so they can work. The smallest truck brought our Play-Doh egg. Let's go ahead and open it and see what construction materials do we have in here. And look at this, some brown Play-Doh. 
perfect for helping build our street. We can have this worker that has this jackhammer try to break through the pieces. I have this Tonka sawmill here. We can use this to mold our bricks. This is the perfect tool. Be sure to check out the video on this toy. Click the eye above. I'm going to go ahead and link it for you. I'll show you the review on it and the unboxing of it. But here, let's go ahead and fill our spot with our brown Play-Doh. And here come our bricks. Look at this, we have three bricks here. We're going to need to work them further so we can size them up and cut them the right size. But this is a perfect start. our excavator to load them in our truck. Here comes the second truck to work. We can load the smaller ones into that truck. Bring it over and dump it. Since our trucks are loaded, the excavator is finished. Not only are we going to open a die cast action play set, this is an airport set that has a lot of fun pieces. We're also going to be opening some surprise Spider-Man eggs. And we have a full basket of them. There are 18 in here. And they do include candy. So stay tuned until the end of our clip as we will open each and every one of these 18 Spider-Man eggs. Including one toy surprise in one of the eggs. But first, let's go ahead and take a look at our playset. At our airport playset. It includes figurines as well as planes and vehicles. Our first airline that's ready for takeoff is Speed King. And this is a super fun airplane. It has four engines. This is die cast material. It does have plastic parts, so it's a combined die cast and plastic. And it's super duper fun. Our first man on the job is the ground handler. He's actually going to direct traffic on the ground. He has his pallets here, so he can direct the airplane. Looks like Speed King is ready to take off. Next in line to take off is Air Superplane, or AOK. -okay. He's getting the all clear signal to move forward. Speed King Air has taken off. A-OK -okay Air has taken off. We had better set up our signs. A touchdown for Speed King. Here comes the refueling truck. This plane is going to need some gas. Our fuel truck is ready to service the plane. This truck is part of DFS International. Next up we have this truck 
and this is going to bring the snacks and the food to load on the planes. We also have a ladder truck included. This is important as passengers need to get on and off the plane. Included in the collection is this truck. This brings all the luggage to be loaded onto the plane. Here are the people that work at the airport. We have a pilot, a flight attendant, and a fighter jet pilot. Other accessories included in the collection are cones, barrels, signs, lots of them, as well as trees. And now we're going to open our Spider-Man surprises. Our fun 18 eggs. Be sure to stay tuned because we do have a toy in one of the eggs and we don't know which one it is. What are we going to get? So let's go ahead and open up our package here. This is exciting. I love this fun basket that holds everything together. Here's our first egg. Oh, look at this. We got some lemon heads. This is the tropical one. Next up, we have this fun Spider-Man egg. Look at this. What do we have in here? Oh, another lemon head. This is the fruit mix. Here's a yellow one. Which lemon head fruit mix are we going to get? Let's see. Oh, look at this one. The Berry Awesome. We have more Spider-Man eggs to open. Here's the next one. Ooh, look at this. I think this is one that we've had before. The Fruit Mix. Do you love lemon heads? What's your favorite flavor? Be sure to write your comment down below. Here's the next Spider-Man egg. Which flavor are we going to get this time? Another fruit mix? Awesome, I love those. My favorite is actually the, let's see, did we get one? Yes, the tropical one. That's, the, that's my favorite. Here's a blue Spider-Man egg. This looks awesome. Wonder what flavor of lemon heads are we going to get this time? This is the tropical, my favorite. We have a full basket of more eggs to open. Look at this. A lot of yummy goodies in here. A green one. Oh, this is a new one. We haven't seen this one. It's a tropical one, but it has um, blue and pink ones. So different tropical mixes. Here's a fun red one. And this time it's another fruit mix, but we have lemon and orange. Be sure to stay tuned because we do have a toy in one of the eggs and we don't know which one it is. These are so fun to open, I love it. This is a fruit mix with the reds, so the cherries and the lemons. This one is the same thing. Oh, this is a berry awesome. A lot of berry flavors in there. Look how many we've opened so far. We have more. What are we going to get in this one? The fruit mix, but we have apple, orange, and this black one. Here's a yellow one. Ooh. This is the Berry Awesome again, and it has blue, so probably blueberries, and this is red. We have just a few more. And fruit mix. Apple, oranges, and cherries. Berry Awesome again. And this one, let's see, tropical. A lot of fun flavors in here. We're getting to the end of our basket. Let's see, what is this? A tropical one again. 
Mmm, yum. Orange, apple, and blueberry. And this one... This is a tropical, but it has that pink surprise. Also, the blue and the red flavors. It has the pink one, so that's probably lemonade. The red and the blueberries. The red is probably cherry. And our last egg. And this one is really special. I've actually put a toy in here. So what do you think we're going to get? Would you like to take a guess? Be sure to write your comment down below before I open it up and tell me what do you think I've hidden in here? What surprise besides the lemon head? Are you ready? Oh yes, look at this. It's a Lego figurine and he's a pilot. Just in theme with our airport. And then we have a lemon head, and this time we have the tropical one. So it includes a lot of apples and blueberry one. Super fun, look at all these eggs we've opened. We did have one toy surprise, and lots of lemon head candies included. Lots of different flavors. Let's try one. Here's the tropical one, one of my favorites. And I love lemonade, so look at this. I'm gonna try it and see how it is. Mmm. So yummy. Definitely lemony. Check out this fun new collection I'm going to open for you. It's a die cast 40 piece New City Police collection. It includes die cast models of scaled down actual police force cars. There are 40 pieces. So we've got a lot to look at. We're also going to open a surprise egg at the end, so be sure to stay tuned until the end of the clip to see what's inside. Here's the back of it. So let's open it up and take a look at everything and play with it. Oh my goodness, we have a lot to look at. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's first take a look at our vehicles. And here's the first one. This is a SWAT car. You can see the police logo on it. And this one actually is not die cast, even though this is a die cast collection. This one is plastic. Actually, this part over here, the cabin is die cast, but the back here is plastic. This is a super fun car. It's actually a SWAT police station state lines car. This looks like a heavy duty police car and it's ready for any emergency. It can carry the troops inside that will respond to any emergency. Next up, we have this SWAT car. This looks like the chief's car. This is die cast and plastic combined. It has sirens at the top, none of which are working. It looks super fun. Here's another SWAT car, a police SWAT car, of course. This is a Jeep. It's got high wheels, so it's more like a monster truck Jeep. The back is actually for transporting stuff, not for people. It has two seats in the front. Super fun. Next up, I'm going to show you the response vehicle, the emergency response vehicles in the SWAT team. And this one is part of the 911 force. Of course, the police force as well. And this looks like it's got an automatic weapon at the top. This is full die cast, except for this. That's definitely not die cast. It's plastic. It's an armed vehicle. Here's another truck included in the collection. This one's white, and you can see that it's heavy duty. It's full die cast, except for this top here and the back, the bottom of the truck, which are plastic. Everything else seems to be die cast on this. And this is definitely for equipment. And you can see there are some fans there. And this is super awesome. Every SWAT team, of course, has to have a fire truck. And this is the fire truck included. It has a ladder that extends. This is full die cast, except for the ladder. And it's ready for any fire emergency. There is a police chopper included in here. It has rotating rotors. 
It has an open cockpit. And this is die cast. Mostly all of it except for the rotors and these here, the stepping gear. This is super fun and neat addition to the collection because you have to monitor your situation from above as well. And this is the perfect tool for that. You also have a transporter truck, part of the police force, the SWAT police force. It's part of the rapid reaction team. This is fun. Does it actually come off? Let's see. So the transporter truck, or this semi-truck, you can remove the trailer, and here we go. You can put it right back on the truck. Looks super fun. It can carry emergency vehicles right in it, or any other emergency materials. Also included in the collection is this. Now this is an emergency vehicle. It can reach in high places because it has a high extending ladder. So it can go super high. It has a basket at the end for your figurine. And it says here, powerful. Now this vehicle goes with this other vehicle here. The ladder here retracts rather than just going up. For this one, it just goes up while for this one it retracts forward as well. So two different emergency vehicles that can reach in high places. The collection includes a bunch of signs that you can place in your city. This is a neat rack to store them. And there's this sign. Does anybody know what this sign is? If you do, be sure to write your comment down below. But it's a do not enter sign, so if you said that you were correct. This one is a sign that says give way or yield it's that triangle that says to you have to give the right of way to somebody else so you have to slow down and watch out there are more signs included of course this one here it says no left turn there are more signs one that says slow down parking is this way by looking at the sign you know you can park over there there's the essential stop sign. And the last sign from this tray which says to go this way. Straight ahead. Six, seven signs and we have more to show you. Here are the rest of the signs including a barrier, a railroad crossing that goes up and down. There's a barrier sign here. It says to go that way. A highway sign over here. Highway 40 is going this way. There's a no U-turn sign. You cannot make a U-turn at this intersection. Here's a roundabout sign. At least I think that's what it is. I'm not that familiar with this one. A city police sign to mark your city. A slow down sign. This is similar to the yield sign, but it's the other way. It's actually a different kind of a triangle. There's a sign that shows a street going forward or up and a helicopter landing sign. So when your helicopter lands, there's a sign for it. It should land right over here. This is an awesome set. We have a couple more things to show you. These are the additional accessories. We have cones. There's a barrel here that shows a no smoking sign because it must contain a flammable liquid or gas. There's a fire extinguisher. Here's a container that's included and a bunch of barrels. And these come off this rack here. So we have eight of them. Super fun. Now let's go ahead and open our surprise egg. What's in here? What do you think? Oh, look. An egg within an egg. Oh. It's Donald Duck. And what does he have here? He has a soccer ball. So he's playing soccer. Awesome. We have a very fun toy we're going to be opening today. And we're also going to be opening a surprise tattoo egg. And I have included a surprise toy with it. So stay tuned until the end of our clip as we open that. 
But now we're going to open this die cast to metal with plastic parts set. And guess what? It's a space one. It includes a space station. Yeah, it includes astronauts, a space station, a rover. Rocket ships and another rover. Yeah. So it has a lot of fun stuff. Look at this. What What do you think that is? A planet? Could be a planet. That's a good guess. But I think it's some kind of a metal. Space rocks? Space rocks. Yep. Is it up or, di or a street? Oh, the satellites. Look at the satellites. They move. Down. So a satellite can take images and we can use it for intelligence. We can use it to navigate and make maps. These are solar panels that actually capture the sun's rays so it can power it up. How fragile is a solar panel? Well, they're very, they have to be a bit strong because they need to be able to withstand winds, right? So here's our next item in the collection, and this is the space station. It's a model of it, of course. It's supposed to stay like this. It does have <laughs> rotating panels. There are two rockets included in the collection. You can see what they're powered by. There's some mini rockets at the bottom. Engines. Yeah, the rocket engines. Five, four, three, two, one. There are two satellites included in the collection as well. There's a pair of satellites, you can say. Well, if there are two things, it's a pair. So there are two of them, and they're super fun. They go. You can twist the panels. I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a video of mommy. Yeah, satellites can take video. Awesome, there's a fun rover included. It has removable parts and it's ready to go exploring. It says UN and RK on it. Is the space station going out of control? No. <laughs> it's floating. You know we saw a picture of a space station? You know in the space station, when you sleep in the space station, you float around. So the astronaut sleeps in the sleeping bag that's anchored and then is just floating. This is the mat that's actually included in the collection. And yes, it's in outer space. And it's a building in outer space. It's kind of an imaginary thing. This is not real. There are four astronauts included. And what do you notice that they're carrying? Different stuff. Like what? Look, same. Same. Yeah, there are two of the same. Same. So two pairs. And what are they carrying? One of them is carrying a toolbox and one of them is carrying... One of them is carrying tools. Yeah, these are tools. What do you think they're going to be using these tools for? To fix the space station. Awesome, yep. So they're going to work up in space, these astronauts. Also included is a super awesome car. It's a NASA car. It's got monster wheels and suspensions. You can see them peeking through. It looks sort of like a exploring vehicle, doesn't it? Like a terrain vehicle because of the wheels and the suspensions. And this open cockpit here. There are a bunch of signs included, and look at this one. It says Space Shuttle for Sale. An astronaut holding the for sale sign. Awesome. They're looking for buyers. There are a bunch of signs included. There's a no left turn, a stop sign, do not enter, a slow, a parking sign, a one way street sign, and a giveaway sign. Yeah, there's a bunch of barriers here. Awesome. And it says caution on it. There are other signs over here. One of them is says there's a roundabout and there's no U-turn. Out of my way, the barrier. Yes, and a whole barrier for you. Wah! Can we get the boo? Oh man! Wah! Open the barrier! Open! Oh! And oh! You knocked down my signs. There's a rock included. Looks like a platinum or silver rock. It's pretty hollow on the inside. And lastly, there are some cones included and a little barrel. Caution. Another barrier. So two barriers included in the collection. 
Guess what, guys? It's time to open our giant egg. This is part of Disney's Cars, and it includes tattoos, 40 of them, and a surprise toy. Which one is it? I hope it's Mater. This is fun. Oh my goodness, what's in there? A Life Beam McQueen cup. Whoa! How many tattoos? 200. There are 40 tattoos. Do you want to get a tattoo, Patrick? 45. Later. I want a tattoo. I want a one. So here are the tattoos that you get. Look at him. He's like, bleh. <laughs> Who forgot this? There's so many. One for each day for 40 days. You can wear a tattoo daily. Here's what this one includes. To me, this one looks the same as the other one, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks the same. Yeah, so you have, it's a double one. And then you get a surprise toy, and guess who it is? And it's Lightning McQueen. It's Hydro Wheels Lightning McQueen. And this one works on water. Again? Yeah, this is a water toy. Or a beach toy. Very fun, I love it. What a nice surprise. Now let's go ahead and get a tattoo. One of these Cars tattoos. Which one do you choose? You want him? What's his name? Mater. You want Mater? So you're gonna get Mater and I'm going to get... Maru. <laughs> Not Maru, I'm gonna get Lightning McQueen. So here, let's cut out the ones that you want. The first step is to cut off which piece you want. Okay, so this is for Patrick. And now let me cut off mine over here. To the next creature. We need a wet sponge. I don't have a sponge, but I'll use a wet paper towel. You have to remove the film. No, remove the whole thing. Yeah. Here's my tattoo. I'm going to place it on my skin. Where do I want it? Over here? Not, why do you always place it upside down? You have to place it upside down. Then how will we turn back up? And I'm going to put a wet napkin over it. And I need to press in my wet napkin. Press in just to make sure it sticks on. I'll test it. Looks like it's sticking. It needs a bit more time. It says 30 seconds. Alright, so 30 seconds later, we can remove it. <gasps> Look at this! You have to wait a while for a tattoo to get off. Yeah. So this one's supposed to last, how many days does it say? Let's see here. Three to five days. Okay. So Patrick is next. We'll press it in just a bit more. Tested. Yeah, look, it worked. So here's your tattoo. Awesome. What do you think, Patrick? Awesome. Also, love the toys we've opened today. Which one is your favorite part, Patrick? Space Station, of course. Yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to leave a comment down below. Also, subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. If you'd like to subscribe to this channel, be sure to click the red subscribe button. Bye, everyone.